everyone, welcome back to my channel, it's Catherine, and if you're curious about the noise, it's the laundry. And so today, you guys, I'm so, so excited. I finally got the new Better Homes and Gardens holiday scents, and there's nine of them, and so we're just gonna do like a first impressions, cold sniff review just from me, and then I'm gonna use them all, and then I'm gonna do a full review probably in about one and a half weeks or two weeks we'll see um i do have a couple of things to do with school and my internship but let's get started and i'm gonna show you guys what i got so the first one is apple and spice look at that packaging i'm gonna show you guys the color too Ooh, this one has a little bit more of like a fall-esque type of scent from the apple. It smells like it almost has pumpkin, but I think it's just a spice. This one's gonna be really fun to warm up. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for that. And then I got apple and incense. I feel like they should have been a little bit more creative with their names. There's apple spice, apple and incense. Let's see what the wax looks like. It's a nice pretty red. This one has more of like that smoky apple scent rather than the sweeter apple. I don't know if I like it or not. But we'll see, we'll see. This one has more of like a red hot cinnamon with the apple, um, probably from that incense note. Um, next I got hazelnut and cream. You guys, this is gonna be a fun one. Look at that packaging. Oh yeah, work it girl. And that's the color of the wax. This one is really light. When wax is really light on cold, usually it doesn't throw well from my experience pop this bad boy out, which is what I'm trying to do. I don't know how they do it so easily. You can smell more of like a spice note, almost chai. I'm gonna see how that goes out. I, I'm gonna be looking forward to use that. Then I got butterscotch and allspice. I had to go to a different store for this one, guys. I, hopefully this one has a good promise to it. I think I like this one a little bit more than the hazelnut and cream just because it has has a little bit more of like a 3D note to it. It has a little bit of spice and the butterscotch is a little bit weak, but I don't know. We'll see. It has a little bit of apple. I feel like it has apple. And then we got candied cranberries. Ooh. Okay, from first glance, this looks like a super sweet cranberry and then when you smell it, ooh. Oh, it smells like woodsy. It smells like a woodsy cranberry, you guys. Like, this is not what I pictured it to be like. Oh, it's really potent, though. It's really strong. So, if you guys like a woodsy cranberry, try this one out. Just from the cold sniff, I feel like if you like woodsy notes, you should try that one out. We have Mary Berry Merlot. This one's going to be really fun. I never had a wine scent before, I don't think. It kind of has a little bit of like a fake cherry note because sometimes with cherry notes, they can't really do it well. This one is just, I don't know. I don't know. If you guys had the scent, what do you think? I feel like they could have gave it a little bit more of like a darker cherry, like a Dr. Pepper dark cherry rather than like a imitation cherry. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see how that one is. Next, I got the cherry and balsam. This was what the wax looks like. Ooh. This one reminds me of Black Cherry Merlot from Better Homes and Gardens. Wow. I feel like, I feel like this one is the best cherry out of all of them or like the cranberry notes. This one smells so good, you guys. Oh my gosh. This one smells like Black Cherry Merlot. A little bit. I would definitely recommend getting this one firsthand just because it smells really good on cold. Lastly, I got two of the Christmas tree scents. The first one is Blue Spruce and Tinsel. And usually I do not get these type of scents, but because I like doing YouTube videos, I want to show you guys everything. Ooh, ooh, okay. This one has like a more masculine cologne scent rather than like a tree scent. This one's good. Oh, I like that one. I like that one a lot. And then we have the Magic Mistletoe Kiss. The packaging is everything, you guys. Look how cute that is. And then the wax is green, like an emerald green. That smells so, that smells so good. Okay, I can, on the bottom, I can smell more of like that 
green tree spruce scent and then the top i smell more of like a cologne scent wow that smells so good and this looks really good too wow i was really doubting these tree scents you guys they're more cologne -y than anything but i'm really excited to try these but yeah um i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know in the comments down below what you guys like and if you guys are going to get any of the new holiday scents i would definitely recommend from the smelling point cherry and balsam i think that one smells really good but yeah i will see you guys soon bye